Hey guys, so I know this is like really different, but I'm going to show you guys how to do a really cool like prediction card trick. So first I'll show you how to do it, and um, and then I'll show you what it looks like all together. So first what I do is I pick out four cards and write them down. And this is just on the back of a business card. So the, two, the cards I picked out was... The Two of Hearts, Four of Spades, Queen of Hearts, and Nine of Diamonds. So these are my four cards. Now, um, I like it when they turn out in order from lowest to highest, but you can really put these in any order if you want. But if you want the person to uh, choose these cards, choose these cards in order. I'll show you which order to put them in. And I did not come up with this trick. I saw it on YouTube and I just like this is how I do it. So and I I'll I believe I can't remember what it's called, the original trick name. But yeah, so I have my prediction ran down there. And now I'm gonna take two random cards and put them face to face. Like this. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the 9, so I have my two cards here, okay? So I'm going to put the 9 on top, and then the 2. Then I'm going to flip this over, and I'm going to put the Queen, and then the 4. So, you're going to make sure that the 4 is on top when you put it on top of the deck. Okay, so now what you're going to do is kind of ruffle through and the person's going to say stop. So then you flip it over whenever they say stop and you're just going to shuffle through and say the first um, back of a card I see, so this one, is your card and it should be the two. And then you're going to take this pile and put it underneath. You can do the same thing, so tell me when to stop, and be very careful when you ruffle through so they don't see the cards, and also be careful when you're shuffling through because you don't want them to accidentally see, like, oh, <laughs> like, because see, if you do it too much, they'll see there's two cards. So again, pop these on the bottom, next card should be the four. And then exact same thing, so you're going to shuffle through, there it is, pop these on the bottom. Ignore the jack, don't do what I did. <laughs> and then pop that down there. Alright, now just one last time. You would shuffle through, but just for time purposes. And this is the one you have to be the most careful on. So I'm just going through very carefully. There's your last card. So now, for the last card, I'll pull this off and then set this back on top. So that just in case if the top card moves or something, um, you won't see that there are two face-up cards. So now you say, so if you would hold, hand this over to someone and at the beginning of the card trick and say, I want you to hold this tightly in your hand and don't let it go. So, and then you'd say, okay, I want you to flip over the cards and so it'll be these in this order. And you're going to say, okay, now um, I made a prediction and I want you to open this up. And then boom. It's what you predicted. So um, I just think that's a really cool card trick. It also helps if you already have the card, like the deck set up before you do this. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. It's a little something different. And thank you so much for watching. So that's it. Bye.